survey program. You will accept everything that will happen from now on. I agree. Are you these? There, shit. Are we connected? Got. Turn you down. Excellent. Truly excellent. Now, we may begin. Why is it called survey program? First, you must create a vessel. Select the head that you prefer. Let's see if I can full screen you. Can I full screen you? Alt, enter, enter. Yep, there it goes. Whoop. Did we lose it? Yep. Oh. Come on, we can do this. There we go. There we go. Yeah, it's full screen. Okay. I didn't mean to. This is your body. No. Oh no, A and B are reversed. Okay, so tapping it out made the things go all, all fucky. Alright, let's choose a head. Would you like... Wow. We have character customization this time around. So yeah, we're playing Deltarune. It just kind of starts, apparently. With no... <laughs> it just, just kind of surprised me. Uh, so for those who don't know, this is... I believe it's the sequel to Undertale. Basically. Or at least I think it features characters from Undertale. Or something. And so on. Uh... I was a little tempted to not, like, it, it I, I did that poll a while back and it did well, but I was a little iffy on playing it because it's apparently chapter one, like it's an incomplete game or something, but, and who knows how long it'll take for them to come out, but sure, let's just play them as they come out. Uh, also, I need a game to bridge the gap from Ashen to Sekiro coming out, so this sounds like a good idea. Let's pick ourselves ahead. Is that like a... Scar on your face? These are like slightly confusing pixels to like make out the shape of. Let's do this one. Would you like. Oh! The arms are slightly different. I was confused at first. Like, what's different about these torsos? Like, what type of shape would you like to have? Let's be this guy with little buttons. Which legs would you prefer? It really is a game of spot the difference, isn't it? What is the difference? I can't see the difference. You're messing with me, right? They're like the same legs. But what are we doing here? What's the difference? Is the height change? No, and the width change staying the same. I think right, 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 left. Like at the very end, the left leg is bigger instead of the right leg. But that's it. They all look like they're the same legs forever. It's freaking me out, man. It's freaking me out, man. This is your body. Do you accept it? Yes? Excellent. You have created a wonderful form. Now, let us shape its mind as your own. What is its favorite food? Sweet? Soft? Sour, salty, pain? Cold. Pain? <laughs> My favorite food is pain. <laughs> Uh, soft? Go sweet? Your favorite blood type? Uh, s 
see what color does it like most. None of these are purple. Blue? Please give it a gift. Kindness, mind, ambition, bravery, and voice. What does voice mean? Curious about that one. How do you feel about your creation? It will not hear. <laughs> it will not hear what you feel about them. I fear my creation. Have you answered honestly? As honestly as one can answer what their favorite blood type is. You acknowledge the possibility of pain and seizure. Yes. Understood. Name your vessel. Uh. Oh boy. Vasti. All the way back to Dragon Age. We called it Vasti. And what about the creator? It's being explicitly spelled out as being not me. Because I have a name. Heath. Excellent. Truly excellent. Keith. Thank you for your time. Your answers. Your wonderful creation. Will now be discarded. No one can choose who they are in this world. Your name is... Chris? Hey. <laughs> my mouse on the screen anywhere? Where's my mouse? Oh, it's not in the window at all. Cool. Chris, if you do not wake up, we will be late for school. I will wait outside for you, all right? <laughs> and disregard that character entirely. Is Chris now the canon name of the character from the first game? Is this the same universe? I don't know. It's a computer desk. There are many boxes under it filled with old books. There are CDs under the bed. Classical, jazz, religious ska. There's probably a comma there. It's probably religious ska. Not like religious ska. There's also a game console. And there's one normal controller and one knockoff one. The drawer is mostly empty except for a school cross country shirt with a tear a tear in it. It's a beautiful day outside. Closed drawer. It's a red wagon with a rusty bird cage in it. Looks like it's seen quite a few crashes. Hang on, that's an explicit Ocarina of Time look or Zelda carpet, isn't it? The Triforce slightly inverted and then the fairy. There are many books. Tales of Snails, a storybook. Snails do not have tails. A scientific refutation? <laughs> Could snails help your garden? Um, not really. An assigned copy of The History of Humans and Monsters by Gerson Boom. There are crayons in the drawer. The labels have long faded. There's no garden. There's no- and there's no green. Well, it's because green's not a creative color. A cactus. There's not much to say about it. So if you haven't been around for the long ride, uh... I have already covered in Undertale for it. I did a neutral run back when the game first came out. And then I did a pacifist run immediately afterwards that then went on hiatus for three years. And I think three years. And then finally got wrapped up last year, finally. So I just saw the pacifist ending last year-ish. Uh, and now we're back. I haven't done genocide yet. We'll see. It's only you. The door is locked. There's no time to read anything now. Who knows, maybe when this game's done, I'll do the genocide run of that game, and then this game, back to back or something, because I, I hate myself. If this game even has runs? I don't know what the mechanics of this game are. There's some white fur stuck in the drain. The photo of the fridge. It's of you, your mother, and your brother. The perspective has changed, huh? 
not only am I probably older now than I was in that game, if I am the same character, but the whole perspective changed from like a more explicit top, top down to this like three fourths kind of angle thing. There's some cinnamony batter are caked in the stovetop. Cookie cutters for gingerbread monsters and gingerbread humans. Uh, so like if I, uh, if I, uh, even if I am the same person at the same age, I would look taller at this camera angle, I think. Trash can. Somehow it's emitting a pleasant floral scent. Landline phone, but you already have a cell phone. It's Cheriel, the beloved living room chair. For, to for Toriel? It's the TV. Doesn't seem to even be plugged in anymore. And it's the stupid chair that no one cares about, apparently. It's a book of hymns. These chairs are in the reverse direction of the... I guess they don't use the TV, apparently, yeah. Because these chairs are even in the reverse direction. What's this way? The bathroom. You looked inside the sink cupboard. There's a can of Icy's Cool Boys body spray. Spray for the boys! Flame and hot pizza flavor. Flavored body spray? Gross. It seems to be almost entirely full. The toilet. Flush it? Yes. Oh, it's my first decision. This will change the entire game. You flush the toilet. On the shower ledge, there's a small container of apple-scented shampoo and a gallon-sized container of pet shampoo. A gallon-sized container of pet shampoo? Because all these giant monsters are using pet shampoo. Chris, there you are. We might still be able to make it. So the idea here is that the pacifist ending is, is the canon one, right? And then we're trying to realize what the world would be like if everyone made it out. Chris, oh, I hope it stays this way when Asriel, but I wonder, after the excitement of the university, will he still enjoy coming home to this little town? There's, those are familiar characters. Call, call back to last game where the op in the opening you think you're gonna have this adventure and then Toriel leads you by the hand through an entire zone and you can't make any choices yet. So, d does everyone have a... Oh, and Chris! I thought you weren't coming today. We're doing group projects this month. Uh, so... Walk around and find a partner, okay? You can be my partner. What? What am I watching on my phone? It's schoolwork, of course. Uh, animated schoolwork, and... Uh, hey, Chris, have you chosen a partner yet? What is that? Uh, that's Falco. That's the deer from that one webcomic. That's Temmy. That's Spike Lizard Boy. I think that's the bird creature from the main game. I remember you. Snake. Cool snake. Alright. Can I talk to them one by one, or do I pick the first one I click on, or what? Chris Bella Versus Tamil Raya Partner. What? What'd you just do? I need to look at that again. Tim Partner with EG. Do the animation again. What did you do a second ago? Yo, Chris, show up earlier next time. I ended up having to partner with Snowy. <laughs> now he keeps turning to me and saying, Howdy, partner, like a cowboy. Partner? I hardly knew her. Haha. <laughs> what do you think of that one? Funny, right? No? Well, I got news for you, pal. I already got a partner. Scram. Uh, uh, uh. Ah, Chris, late again, I see. Uh, uh, hmm, you need a partner? Uh, uh. Sorry, I'm already partners with the second smartest student. Though, so, wait, Chris, now that I think about it, your unique skill set might help a lot in this assignment. Pfft, not. I actually want to get an A. What is that? What is that uh, pixel out on the left? Are you roadkill? Jeez. 
Briss, you know Jockington and Caddy are always partners. We're the ultimate academic duo ever since our first gym class. It was hula hoop day, and then they ran out of hoops for us, so she used me instead. That's our origin story. <laughs> Taken. Ah. Suddenly sound. Way high, way more noticeable sound, I guess. Hey, Chris. What's up? Did you lose your pencil again? Here. You want the candy cane one or the one with the lights on it? Huh? You want to be partners? Um, sorry. Thirdly already asked me. But I could ask myself if we could make a group of three. I was gonna say, aren't there eight people? They already partnered up. I'll ask if you're sure. Yes. Ask. Okay, I'll ask. Miss Alphys, um, is it okay if we have a group of three? Hey, what? No, I do not approve of this. Abort. What? But Chris doesn't have a... Oh well, were you saying something? She was just saying we're fine being alone. Uh, actually, I just wanted to know if... Oh well, could you speak up, please? Wait, we only have nine... We only have nine tables. Uh, hi, Susie. Am I late? Oh, no, you're fine. We we just, uh, choosing partners for the next group part project and, um, Susie, you're with Chris. Great. Now that everyone's here, uh, I'll write the assignment. Why are you terrified of your own student? Oh, no. Has anyone seen the chalk? I think Temmy might have it. I don't know what that is. This is the third time it's gone missing, and... Y you all know I can't start class without some. How about this? If no one speaks up, everyone gets in trouble. Uh, anyone? Please? Hey, there might be a box in the supply closet. Miss Alvis, why don't Susie and I... Good idea, Noelle. S Susie, since you came in last, why don't you go get it for me? Whatever. And C Chris, can you... Can you go with her and make sure she, uh, actually gets it and uh, stays out of trouble? Thanks, Chris. You, you see you later. This is the punishment we severe. We, we, this would have. This is the punishment of people who have long ass hair. Did you just eat the chalk, or what was that? Chris, didn't see you there. Hey, you didn't see anything just now, did you? Hmm. You can't even say. Chris. Hey. <laughs> this is strangely creepy. Let me tell you a secret. Hey! Quiet people piss me off. Aren't you? I thought you were the quiet type. You think just because you don't say anything? I can't tell exactly what you're thinking. It's over. I caught Susie eating all the chalk. This was her last chance. Now she'll finally be expelled. Haha. <laughs> Come on, Chris, don't ask- uh, don't act shocked. You know it's true. Everyone's waiting for it. Everyone wants it. So, congrats, Chris. You got me. I'm done for. Just... let me say one little thing. Seems like a waste to get expelled just for having a snack. So, Chris, if I know you're gonna pull the trigger... <laughs> Why don't I just get expelled for some real carnage? Chris, how do you feel? About losing your face. That's a severe... Jesus Christ. Nah. Chris, you've got a good mother. It'd be a shame to make her bury her child. Alright, let's get this over with. We'll get more chalk. Mosey back to class. And then, Chris, you'll do our project. How's that sound? 
Don't bother answering. <laughs> it just fast forwarded before I could click anything. If you haven't gotten it by now, your choices don't matter. Let's go, freak. This game's just kicking me <laughs> over and over again. You made a character? J just jokes on you. You flush the toilet? All right. Well, I see what's happening. Black was covered in, in jocking to memorabilia. All right, well, that got sh distressingly dark very quickly. For not a lot of reason, either. This locker is locked. Who could have thought? This locker's lock is locked. This locker's lock is locked. This locker's lock's locker is locked. Are you ready for the Sadie Hawkman's dance? At the dance, all the chaperones wear giant hawk heads. And screech at any students that make contact while dancing. Chris? What? Realize the baby classroom was a better fit for you? Hey, actually, I should come with you. Maybe I'll find a better partner in there. Nah, actually, that's not. Wrong way, Chris. Well, I'm, I'm heavily controlled here. Chris? You just gonna skip school? What? Am I supposed to snitch on you? That'd be rich, huh? Nah, I wouldn't go. I wouldn't get back here. Chris, if you skip school, your mom will have a heart attack. Strong reactions here. I can't tell if that per if they're grinning or biting their lip when the vertical lines show up in their pixel art. God, can you walk any slower or what? Nah, I get it. Not used to walking around without someone holding your hand. Come on, freak. Well, here's the closet. Too bad. We were just starting to have fun. Uh... <laughs> that side eye. There goes all the cool that they supposedly had. Hey, Chris, is it me or is it really dark in there? What's the holdup, Chris? Are you gonna go in or what? Fine. If you're gonna be a wimp, then I'll... We'll both go in at the same time. <laughs> See? Why are you so scared? There's nothing in here but old papers. Let's try to find a light switch. This person's heavy on the projecting, huh? Chris, if you leave me here, I'll... <laughs> That's weird. I can't find a switch. Guess it's further in. Yeah, that's how rooms work. The door is gonna close behind us. Uh, kind of big for a closet, huh? You'd think we'd have reached the end by now. Well, just just keep going, huh? Hey, Chris. I think this closet's uh broken. <laughs> there aren't any walls. Well, we've worked hard enough. If Alphys wants chalk so bad, she can get it herself. Let's split. Yep. I thought that we weren't going to find our way back. Like, there just wouldn't be an opening. What the? Hey. This isn't funny. Let us out. Let us. The floor. It's... Okay. Are we back in the monster world, but now without all the monsters? Wait, I'm in a... Did we merge into one person, or am I just suddenly in armor? I think I'm, I'm in armor and I'm green? What the hell? Is this a At times, you see it flickering. The light only you can see. By second nature, you reach out and... Uh... Did I just save over an old save, basically? Or something?
I just so Keith just saved over Chris's save. I think is what I uh, what said there, right? I I clicked a little too fast before registering what happened. Hi, hi. Let's wave back, Keith, Chris, or whatever. I don't like how this wall has a face. Like a puppy teddy bear that's bleeding out of its uh, sockets. Okay. Is this... Un is this Undertale or Yuma, Yuma Nikki? <laughs> it's too dark to see anything. <laughs> okay. <laughs> The sound startled me. But also, I kind of went up against that last time and nothing happened. I don't like the crying puppy walls. I don't like that at all. Oh god, what does that one do when it waves? There's something glowing inside. Take it. Those yes and no are really spaced out, huh? No. It stayed. Now let's take it. You got the glow shard. Do I have an inventory? Ah! Item. Use toss key. I have a cell phone. He tried... That's a sound. Doesn't seem to be working. A wooden practice blade with a carbon reinforced core. So I have a weapon. Human body contains. Level 1 human body contains a human soul. Um. Distressing thing to spell out. Oh, yeah, I got a little health bar on the bottom there. My guts is. Fire. <laughs> Amplify VFX. Auto run. Hmm. Is there a run button besides the auto run? There it is. You hold A. Ah! Okay. I have the heart that dodges projectiles in real life now. Instead of during a- like in the middle of a match, I just am in the world like that. You bathed your body in the light. A power shines within you, breaking through the darkness. Any pain you may have had melted away. Hit points fully restored. What is up with the time, it keeps saying? I puzzle. It keeps- Oh, it's saying that I'm 40 minutes in, right. In this land, only eyes blinded by darkness can see the way. It was moving too fast and I was confused thinking like, what? How is it? Why is it saying like it's been like an hour? Or 30 hours? They must want to black them all out. But, I. Yeah, the, the little dots saying which ones they would affect. Uh, that's what happened, is I was sli sli probably slightly off last time. Uh... Are you okay? Buddy? Feeling congested? Did something just happen on the edge of the screen? Hey, back off. Come any closer and I'll... C Chris? Phew. Hey, don't scare me like that, dumbass. Unless you want to get clocked in the face. <laughs> anyway, enough screwing around. We gotta find a way out of here. Uh, where is... here, anyway? It doesn't matter. You got us into this mess. You get us out. Lead the way, Chris. 